We have an exciting video today. Why well, it's exciting? It is okay. So Hi. I don't know how many of you all like Starbucks, but they came out with a new drink today, which is March twenty second. At like six in the morning, they announced it that there was a crystal ball frappuccino. <music> No, this is limited time only, like the zombie frappuccino, the Christmas tree frappuccino. Unicorn. Yeah. Which we tried we tried to taste test those and we never got to because they sell out super fast. Super fast. But today we got the crystal ball frappuccino. Yeah, look at those little sprinkles on it. I guess it comes in like green, blue, or purple. We got, I mean, you don't get to pick the color. They just give you one. We got a green one. So we're gonna taste it and let you guys know what it tastes like. Okay, whatever. Perfect. So I'm not gonna look at your reaction. So I'm not gonna taste Molly, it. stop! Don't, don't make any noise. Oh, I'm so scared. Are you done? What? <laughs> Look at Molly. She keeps scratching my shoulder. <laughs> Are you done? <laughs> I'm not gonna say nothing yet. <laughs> okay. Since she tasted it already. Really? Definitely not what I expected. It kind of tastes like oatmeal to me. Yeah. I, it's a very uh, unique flavor. I mean, it's not gross. It just really tastes like oatmeal. Yeah, I don't think I would drink that like on a regular if it was like an everyday kind of yeah, what do you need there? drink. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you getting mad? Oh, no, it's okay. It's oh okay. shoot. It's okay. Okay. But yeah, I mean, it it does taste like oatmeal and not like the fruit kind, like just the regular. Like plain oatmeal. Oh. Yeah, Is that taste? necessary? Are you done? Thanks. But yeah. It looks pretty. Maybe if you mix it. I like how it looks ombre. It's cold in here. Does it still taste the same? Mm. That's really weird. I feel like it tastes worse than before. <laughs> <laughs> I'd give it like a 3 out of 10. Like, I don't know. Yeah. It's just like not good a, to me. Like a two and a half, three. I don't know. I would, like, I don't even, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what we're going to do with it. <laughs> That's why I didn't get two when we just shared because I knew it would probably be nasty. I, well, I wonder if the other ones tasted good. Because, what was this, the unicorn one? We heard it tastes like sour milk. Zombie one, I don't know because we never got to try it. Or the Christmas tree. Or the tree. Christmas tree one. They shouldn't come up with other ones. I think they're cool. You know? But they're gross. <laughs> I don't know. It's nasty. You trying to take a big chug? No, what the heck? I don't know. That's gross. I feel like it's, I don't know. I'll stick to the regular caramel frappuccino one. This reminds me of something other than oatmeal. Oh, and it just reminds me of oatmeal. All right. 
But anyways, so yeah, we decided that the crystal ball frappuccino tastes like oatmeal. It's um, a no for me. I honestly would not recommend it. I think I mean, it's not disgusting, but you have to like really love oatmeal in order for you to drink it. I like oatmeal, but I I wouldn't drink it. Same. I like oatmeal, but I don't. I could not drink that. Yeah. So we give it a three out of ten, and we're probably just gonna throw it away. Mhm. Mm because it's not really that good. So that's what we're doing. And that's about it. So that's our little taste test on the crystal ball frappuccino. So that's gonna be the end of our video. Um, subscribe if you're new, comment down below any other video suggestions, and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And if you didn't like it, you can hit the fuck off button. Bye. Bye.